thought? What's on your mind, boo? I'm just in deep thought, but I do want to say uh, congratulations, and I truly do appreciate uh, the Georgia Department of the NAACP, and I'll tell mm. you why. They are definitely shining light on some uh, political injustices yes. that are going on right yeah. here in the state of Georgia. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, the Secretary of State, Brian Kemp, He's the Republican nominee for governor, mm -hmm. and he is also responsible for mm -hmm. uh, the voters' registration and, mm -hmm. and the applications being able to be pushed through correctly, right? right? Absolutely. Uh, from my understanding, there are 53,000 applicants that are currently right now being withheld mm -hmm. from actually being able to get that stamp and approval to say, yes, you can go out and vote right. with this coming upcoming election, with 70% being African-American people. Yes, mm -hmm. so I'm so glad that you're bringing that to light, Yes, and, and I know you we all have to make sure that we're so in tune with voter suppression. That we're woke. Mm -hmm. We are woke. And so, oh, absolutely, just like we had Woke Wednesday this week, we have to make sure. If we could pull that um, that tweet up one more yeah. time, if you guys don't mind, if we could pull that up, I would love to, to read that. It's coming up in just a second. We're working up on, on that just a second because I wanted to read that. But the fact that you brought that up and the fact that we have to really make sure that we are doing what we need to do to make sure people are uh, getting what they deserve and making sure that they are able to vote. Here it is, uh, breaking. The Democratic Coalition just reported Georgia Secretary of State Brian Kemp to the Department of Justice Civil Rights Division for Ra Voting Rights Act violations. Kemp's efforts to suppress Georgia voters in general, especially for its, his own benefit, will not be tolerated. I just want to know why was he allowed to still hold that position and run for office? Right. It right. is a huge conflict of interest. Absolutely. It is absolutely it is. ridiculous. Yeah, absolutely. And uh, the gubernatorial nominee or candidate Stacey Abrams uh, Democratic gubernatorial uh, candidate is trying to get him to step down he, so yeah, yeah he needs absolutely. to step yeah. down from that that is that is unacceptable, mm -hmm. unacceptable. absolutely so and we'll, now look right exactly exactly so thank you for bringing yes. that up and we yes. will definitely make sure that we're in the for keep making sure we're in the forefront of pushing that forward and making sure these voters can vote so come we November gotta right. turn up right. people who are registered know they're registered please make sure that you vote yes yes, yes. and it's just important listen our whole platform here is to inform and educate and if yes. we're not doing that then we're not doing yeah. our job right yeah. absolutely you know yeah. absolutely all right all right good people georgia step up stand out how about that <laughs> <laughs>